five atelectasis. So atelectasis is basically a complete or partial collapse of the entire lung or a lobe of the lung. It occurs when the tiny air sacs, the alveolar within the lung, become deflated or possibly filled with alveolar fluid. So what are the signs of lung collapse? So if you look at a whole lung collapse, there will be a complete opacity of the hematorrhex, displacement of the mediastinum to the side of the opacity. So if you remember when we talked about pneumothorax, displacement is to the opposite side. In collapse, it's displacement to the affected side. Celloid sign will be lost, loss of diaphragm and mediastinal outlines, herniation of the unaffected lung across the midline. So let's look at this. So you're able to notice this complete opacification of the left hemithorax, but you see the mediastinum and the contents, including the trachea, have displaced to which side? To the affected side. With absence of any lung markings, So basically, if you look at this, everything is done. We saw this complete opacity. We saw the displacement of the mediastinum. Silhouette so sign with loss of diaphragm and mediastinal outline. You're able to notice that. There is loss of right cardiac body. Then herniation of the unaffected lung across the midline. Are you able to see that this is moving slightly towards the left side? So what are the signs of lobar collapse? Increased density due to loss of aeration, crowding of the blood vessels, displacement of the hilum upwards or downwards, displacement of a fissure which may be bored, shifts of the mediastinum trachea towards the collapsed part of the lung, elevation of the diaphragm silhouette sign, the remainder of the lung may be overexpanded and hypertranslucent with fewer vessels showing, and rib crowding may occur in children or with long distance, long standing collapse. So if you look at this, this is a what? Right upper lobe collapse. Able to see there's absent of vascular markings. There's bowing of the fissure. Then I don't know if you're able to see the trachea has moved to the affected side. So basically that's all about lobar collapse. So atelectasis of the right lung. Homogeneous density in the right hemithorax, mediastinal shift to the right, right hemithorax is larger, right height and diaphragm 